My name is Chili and I complete things. I am a recovering jeweler in a junkie. I put this account to bed in 2017 and it's about time I revive it. Join me on a completionist journey as I look to fill in collection log slots, obtain pets, and complete the hardest tasks in the combat achievement diary. What we do here is go back, 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 back. <laughs> Fasani's Nightmare. Last week I was fortunate enough to get the sleepy oh, tablet on rate. Yes. Yes. Fasani's Nightmare is a bloody tricky boss and it has a lot of combat achievements that I need to complete. On the road to the sleepy tablet, I got a fair few done, so I only have a few left to go. I have three left to do and I specifically waited to get the sleepy tablet before I attempted these. The easiest should be I would simply react. All I have to really do is focus up on the final phase and one tick flick my prayers to ensure Fasani doesn't disable them. Perfect Fasani Nightmare is a pain in the backside because you're not allowed to make any mistakes at all. Can't Wake Up seems to be the hardest one as you have to kill Fasani's Nightmare five times in a row without leaving the room. Ooh, 100 KC. I should soon be on rate for a drop. Right, I don't mean to alarm you or anything, but I think this is my last beekeeper piece, which means I have a green log for the bee. I don't even know if beekeeper has its own section in the log, but this should be a green... Never mind. The fly is coming. I feel it in my head. Oh, perfect timing. Mm, shit. No, not that it. No, oh, one HP. Are you kidding, brother? All right. What? I just thought I was in the instance and it was about to wake up. This boss has such a negative impact on my mind. I swear my brain is completely fried. My friends, so it begins. Probably my toughest grandmaster achievement attempt to date. I'm going to try and kill Fasani's nightmare five times without leaving the room. Okay, let's grab a stam here, drink it up, put it back in and grab a angler. Okay, I've managed to do a few kills without eating any food at all, just because the sang can heal you up and uh, blood fury is really OP. Only problem with doing this is that kills cost, I think it's about 700k per kill. So if I fail this a lot, it's going to be really expensive just because of the cost of the sanguine SD, the scythe and the blood fury. I know what you're thinking. You have a 2.69 bill bank. Why are you complaining about money? Well, watch this. Boom, I'm poor. Okay, so one thing I really want to focus on is turning my prayers on and off when attacks are coming, as well as one tick flicking during phases. But when your prey is shuffled, it gets a bit confusing. Also, if I one tick pray, oh shit. If I one tick prayers here, it means that I can get another task done, which will be the I can you move? I can't see the I would simply react task. If my SGS pops off like this every time, I'm going to be fine. Yo, Casey, one out of five done at Fasani. Um, not the best drop. I can't really do anything with it. Fasani's nightmare indeed does have food on its drop table. It's uh, rather common to get food but chances are i could easily go five kills without getting any so i can't really rely on it to carry me my way through this task switches are so slow ah! oh that was rough oh i got the i would simply react task i was flicking my my prayer on p3 there I was flicking them all the other times as well, but I didn't get the task, so I don't know how I did then, but I guess it's really hard to tell when Fasani deactivates your prayer during the last phase anyway. Right, I've only used three sand fuse, uh, so it's going pretty well. Please heal me, Sanguinesti staff, come on, <laughs> please. All right, that kill was good. Um, I recovered quite well. I made a few mistakes. So um, 
luckily the sang went off and my blood fury went off too so could do a food but eh. oh blood fury plus sgs heal next clip's kind of funny because i didn't realize how loud i had the game sounds on but Pretty sure I said something about reconsidering my inventory setup if I was to fail. Cause uh Th there it is. Right there. His freaking tail sw sways in the way of the tile that I want to click, and I get hit at 32. CBA. Okay, so um, earlier I was talking about a revised setup. I didn't take thralls because I thought that would use way too much prayer. I nearly finished the task there and I had so many um, Sanfu serums left. Despite them costing so much money to use, I think it's worth me taking thralls. All right, <laughs> holy voice crack. Off me, okay, I'm sick. Um, got my stuff back, gonna pot up and go back in. Fasani Nightmare, the kind of guy to be like, well, 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 when he sees me hop back in the room for the second time. <laughs> Right, absolute shambles. I've been inspired recently by Boaty and Guide for Us All's videos of like, you know, having a bit more live commentary in there. So I've, you know, tried to make some changes here by providing live commentary, but I've, you can't hear any of it because my game sounds are cranked to the maximum. Ooh. Because this is an instance, I'm pretty sure these stay on the floor. So... I can just uh, gobble these up at any point during this run now. These are the game sounds down. What? This is huge. I'm kind of disappointed because I nearly got a perfect run there. I didn't take any damage to that phase. A perfect Fasani kill will be the only challenge I have left after I complete these five kills. All right, three kills left and I have all this food. It should be free. Kill number four brings us in 123 soul runes. I... I don't know what to say. I, w I was daydreaming. I was actually daydreaming about what I was going to have for dinner tonight. Well, let me tell you, it's rice and beans now. All right. Cool. KC1 okay, done. Hey. My sang's out of blood runes. Of course it's out of blood. Ah! Of course it's out of blood runes, man. I've, been, I've spent like 10 mil in blood runes to try and do this shit. All right, um, I've returned. I have everything charged. I think I've spent well over like seven mil attempting this already. <laughs> it's so stupid. Hopefully I'll look back on this in a few weeks time when I'm better at the boss and just be like, ah, how did you not be able to do this, you idiot? Yeah, please. All right, KC3. I'll be honest with you, it's not looking good, Brev. Took 10 minutes to kill that one. And I am low on food. So I need to like not be bad. All right. I've just checked my OBS um uh which is my recording software and i've noticed that i've had the desktop audio cranked really loud and the mic was at the same if not lower volume so i'm really scared that all of my fasani nightmare kills are just going to be me talking over game sounds and you can't hear it whoa that was a big hit all right kc four done so i'm on the last kill now snapdragons the best drop you can get that isn't a unique all right yeah just one kill left let's uh get this done Calmly does it. 
Easy. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. It's done. The Grandmaster task. Can't wake up. Five Fasani kills without leaving the room. Nice. I'm pretty happy with that. I don't think it was as hard as the Corrupted Gauntlet ones, but it was still pretty challenging. I really enjoyed it, actually. I've only got one CA task left for Fasani's Nightmare. I can sell my SGS now and uh, focus on that, which is the perfect Fasani Nightmare kill. I'm actually quite enjoying the boss, and I'm thinking of going for a unique. So I assume I will get that perfect Fasani kill on the road to a unique. I've nearly got it countless of times, but I just let sleepers slip through at the end. So if I focus on making sure that they do not go inside of the dark hole, then I should be able to get it pretty easily. Well, let's talk about the Nightmare Uniques. They're pretty rare. According to the Wikipedia, I have a 1 in 200 chance to hit the Armor, Mace, or Staff drop table. A 1 in 1,000 chance to hit the Orb drop table, which contains some of the most expensive items in the game. Overall, I have a 1 in 167 chance to get a Unique at Fasani's Nightmare. <laughs> Oh, I was perfect that kill. I didn't even have my replay buffer on until the end because I thought I wasn't. Um, here's my log. I currently got nothing in it and I'm nearly on rate. I say nothing, but I got the uh, the egg, which is pretty cool. But I don't have the pet. I'd like to get the pet. Maybe I'll grind this until I get the pet. Unless you've been living under a rock, you may well know that this is probably one of the easiest bosses in the game to cheat. I knew that Jagex would soon be implementing a third party client ban. Fortunately, I have a lot of practice with Fasani's nightmare under my belt now. The consequences of Jagex banning people who use disallowed third party clients has been rather amusing. The prices of some of the items that I could be receiving here have, as expected, gone up a lot. Unless I go really dry for an item, I should be making a lot of money here, and I would like some more GP in game so that I could be prepared for the inevitable release of Rates 3. So the background footage there I just used while talking about clients and stuff was from the normal nightmare. It's not very fun to solo. I don't recommend doing it, but I need to do some CAs here. One ticket to minions. Rise of a Gru, please, Quizmaster. Just joking. Let's have a baguette. A rune battle axe. Wow, that's got to be rare, right? Someone check the wiki. Now that I'm done with the combat achievements, it's time to start doing the clue scrolls. <gasps> yes, this will be it. The last piece. All right, Tom, don't make a bees hive of this. Or oh, wait, actually. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> it's done. The beekeeper collection log complete. Have a look at that. Each and every piece. I bet you don't have it. You probably do. All right, let's crack this elite clue open. See if we get a master clue that's very nice and the master clue contains no log tent yeah i called it third ceradom 190 kc now i'm over the drop rate for a unique i am nearly 200 kc and i've not been doing this in best in slot gear i'm kind of addicted to this boss and i feel like i really want to get an item so i've sold my twisted bow and i'm going to buy a harmonized orb and it won't buy all right, I've got an offer in for 585. I'll go back to Nightmare and see if it buys. Oh, I'm also going to start using the Crossbow instead of the Toxic Blowpipe. The Crossbow has a slower attack speed than the Toxic Blowpipe, but it offers more range. You have to mix things up, though, and use melee to kill the last sleeper. The benefits of using this are essentially room for error. Sometimes with a Blowpipe, you can misclick easier as you're running around, so things are moving. As you can see here, I managed to miss one, and I got punished for it. All right, 195kc on this drop, and uh, my home orb still hasn't bought yet. My brethren in Christ, please have bought. I'll go on then. Have a look at that. When did it buy? In During that kill. Great. 585 mil. If my unique is a nightmare stuff and I sell this for a loss, I'll be very upset. 
Cool. Mmm, a leak clue. Oh my god. Casket. Alright, this is my only my tenth elite clue. Wow. Wow. Well, I can't sit here and do Fasani's nightmare all day. So I gotta mix it up and relax a bit. And as I have a harm, I thought I may as well test out Azora where it's best in slot, right? I'm not one to borrow items, but I have borrowed a twist bow for collateral though. I gave the person my inquisitor and other things. A sloppy top. May I get them too? Oh, nice. Serpentine visage. Why is there floor text? I just want the beam. That's really nice though to start the stream with. Okay, so I still need the tans there. I've not done this since so. Uh, well, I've, I've done it very infrequently since the collection log has come out. And then obviously I'd love to get a mutagen. You probably have. Oh, I tick hate that. That was close. Hey, Elite Clue. I might mention this earlier, but I'm going to be doing Elites and not Masters because I don't have much cash to buy Implings. And Implings have actually skyrocketed, so... Oh, well. Slots to fill in with the Elites anyway. Haha, -ha, it turns into a cabbage instead. Aren't you a smarty pants, Alfie? Holy shit. Look at that. It says Ancient Wizard Trio, but if you go a little bit west, you get a Cabbage Man instead. Oh, a Lesser Demon Mask. I'm happy with that. It's a collection log slot. And a... <laughs> I thought that was going to happen. <laughs> All right, let's do another clue, I guess. <gasps> Casket. How have I not had this yet? I filled in a log slot, though. That, that I guess that's fine. Hey, we will take that. Oh, I like, I like my Rocky. I'm dead. I'm alive. <gasps> Oh my god, I got a jar of swamp. What? Let's go. Collection log moment. Huge. Let's have a look at the log. Where is it? That's nice. I actually got jar of swamp on this account. Weird flex. Day one of Zora. When Zora, the day Zora came out. Actually, no, maybe day two. I don't think I killed Zora day one because I was too bad. But it's kind of cool to finally get that in the log. Obviously, I got it before the log came out. Cast oh, I, oh, I fucking double clicked it or something. I got Ranger Gloves and Zami Page 4. It's a nice uh, slot to fill in the Ranger Gloves. Someone's dry on those. I can't remember who. Remind me in the comments. Gonna say casket without any vowels. Oh, Ranger Crown. No, Royal Crown. <laughs> Up the shelves. Love my crown. Love the platy tubes. Nuff said. Oh, let's go. Mage Fang. Elite Clue. Casket. Let's see what's in it. Hmm. Duo Nightmare. I've never done this. This would be fun. You get hit? Oh, yeah, you do get hit, don't you? Oh! Ho, ho! Right, I've gone back to Fasani because I can't even fathom being responsible for anyone else's life at this boss. Oh, Master Clue. All right, it's been a while since I've had a Fasani Nightmare clip <laughs> in this video, I'm assuming, because, uh, yeah, I'm at 300 KC now. Nothing's happened. I don't really have anything to show for it. Um, just the CAs from earlier. 300 is quite a lot to go without a drop here. Hopefully my luck turns around, but the collection log's not looking good. I filled up a lot more slots elsewhere. Here's what the log's looking like currently. Uh, I'm a bit frustrated. It's kind of annoying to not get anything considering kills last like seven to 10 minutes. Hopefully my luck can turn around and um, I can score something. Oh, I can take a break. I've got a clue scroll. So master clues are one in five from elites. And I think in the last eight elite clues, I've had seven masters. All right, 350 for Sani. I've started to stack the masters now because I just I just want to get this drop. Will my God, for Sani is so hard. Yeah, it's pretty rough, man. But you know, you'll get the hang of it, don't worry. Just got to learn how to do that. And you're golden. And then you just need to kill it 766 more times. And what will you have to show for it? Nothing. That's just cringe, isn't it? Uh, I've run out of wrath runes, so I'm just bowing the pillar at this point. Someone save me. Blood runes! 400 kill count without a drop. Whew, that's that's really bad. All right, I have zero log slots filled at Barrows apart from the bolt racks. Um, so 
yeah, this will be fun to fill up. I'm just going to do this to, you know, fill something, I guess. Right, I, I've, I've come to Barrows and I've got nothing. Should I honestly just stick to Zora at this point? It's the only thing that's making me any money at all. Let's go once again, more log slots filled in on the way to Fasani's Nightmare than I have at Fasani's Nightmare. All right, I'm at 450. Fasani's now not even a whiff of a staff. <laughs> yeah, boy. Let's go. <gasps> oh my god holy fuck oh my god it's a big one holy shit oh fuck oh 420 mil spark it up oh my god i can't believe it's a mace ow i've just hit my head on the wall i, I didn't believe it could ever happen oh man i don't know what to do i don't know what to do Oh, it's like made that dry streak so worth it to get something so expensive. It's, oh, I'm so happy. Oh my God, look at me. Just look at me. All right, I thought I'd do a kill with the mace, but <laughs> the, the scythe is a luxury. Let's just say that. I know you have to pay for blood runes, but that was quite a long kill. Oh boy. That's a lot. That's a lot of money. It's like almost half a bill made today. How was the Yogg Studio, Tom? The live stream was good. Looked a fun game. Oh. My. God. Oh. 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 Holy fuck. Oh. oh my God. <laughs> I've made half a bill today. And I've just gotten a Magma Mutagen. Well, almost half a bill. But this probably has to go down as my luckiest day on RuneScape ever. I don't think it, it's so weird how I go so unlucky for over a month and then all in one day, you just, this just happens. Well, to be honest with you, it looks kind of good. I know I've killed 593. I did a load more after I got the mace while I was rendering this video, but I finally got what I set out to do to complete the Fasani CAs and to get a unique drop. I don't know what to do next. I want to fill in more log slots and obviously crack on with the combat achievements, but Raids 3 is obviously around the corner, so I still need to make some money so that I can get some optimal gear. Watch my Twitch stream, God. All right, that's where I'm going to be this month, so come and watch me over there, all right? All right, the bank value is three bill, pretty much bang on. Um, I'm pretty sure all those Fasani kills cost me about 120 mil. So that's pretty interesting, huh? Thank you so much for watching the video. We have a fair few amount of combat tasks left to do, a load of pets to get, and 294 out of 1,404 collection log slots filled. Take care and I'll see you soon.